When I was 20, I had dreams. But I didn't want to grow old thinking, what if I had done it? What if? And so I did. Fast forward my life, I can now say that I've lived in seven different countries, I speak six, almost seven different languages, and I did achieve my dream. And I have new dreams, like standing on a stage like this. Now, how did I do that? I'll tell you in just a minute. First, let me ask you a question. Yeah, I think so. How? Oh, you think? Why are so many of us stuck? Because we think too much. But that's okay. We have 80,000 thoughts in a day. It's normal that we have so many thoughts. But it's when those thoughts are negative that they bring us down. I can't do this. I'm not good enough. If you repeat that over and over again, you'll start believing it. So if you want to change something, you have to change those stories. Is it easy? Is it difficult? If it would be that simple, we would all be famous rock stars or movie stars. It takes effort. But there is a saying, if we always do what we always did, we get what we always got. Now I hear you. Yeah, Rachel, but we love to do what we always do. It feels good, it's easy, it's like an automatic robot, it feels comfortable. True, but comfort is the enemy of change. It's when we're uncomfortable that leads to change in action. You know, when I moved abroad every single time, I took a lot of small steps. Talking to people, visiting countries, applying for jobs. I never jumped in the ocean. I look at the ocean. I look at what's out there. I put a toe in the water and a foot and another foot. Small steps. You want to publish your book? Start by writing a paragraph. But mistakes, I think they're important. I think mistakes are a good thing. We learn from our mistakes. And there is one quote I want to share with you because I can't say it any better. I never make the same mistake twice. I make it five or six times, just to make sure. It's like when you're driving a car. You're driving, you're going to your destination, maybe a short distance, maybe a long distance. You are responsible for your life. So, life changes. And so can you. We can think thoughts and stories in our head that can mean anything. We can take small steps, one foot after the other, into the ocean. We can take a look in that rearview mirror and learn from what we see in there. We all have dreams. So what is your next step? Thank you.